I'm Peter James. I'm a doctoral student in the Departments of Environmental Health and Epidemiology, and I study the built environment and how it impacts human health. Beginning in the uh, year 2008, for the first time ever, uh, greater than 50% of the world lived in cities. And by 2030, this number is estimated to be 5 billion people living in urban areas. Where a person lives can determine their exposure to air pollution, water pollution, can help them to have a healthy diet, or can actually uh, give them opportunities for physical activity. I focus my work here at the School of Public Health on combining information on geographic data and health data. We can't tell people to get physical activity if they're afraid to go outside and walk around their community because of fears of crime. We can't tell people to eat a healthy diet when their only access to uh, food is at a fast food restaurant or at a convenience store. When I began researching public health, I focused on green buildings, looking at aspects of architecture and building design, and how, for instance, increasing ventilation might improve health outcomes, decrease health symptoms, and maybe increase productivity. My advisor here at the School of Public Health, Jack Spengler, uh, helped me to do work in this area. He also gave me the opportunity to study in Sweden, where I looked at a, a cohort study of children and looking at building design um, and building materials and how those might be associated with the incidence of asthma. So I'd like to work for an organization that allows me to play an active role in affecting change to create healthier, more vibrant and sustainable communities. Whether it's crafting policy at a national or uh, local level, or whether it's working with community groups that are perhaps um, not usually represented in development decisions, uh, I would like to use the results of my research to actually go forward and create these changes. 